East Africa's Tanzania is a well-ranked economy in the region with heavy dependence on agriculture. The Tanzanian government is now prioritizing industrialization within the 2025 vision as a pathway for sustainable economic development, raising the largest hydropower station in the history of the nation, grasping a dream that started in the 1960s. On the waters of Rufiji River, 370 kilometers southwest of the commercial capital Dar es Salaam, the dream is coming true with a 2,115 megawatt installed capacity hydropower dam in the Morogoro region, Julius Nyerere Hydropower Project. As part of the historic African National Corporation, Egypt's president, El Sisi, assured commitment to enhance joint cooperation in different fields with more joint investments and exchanging expertise in major national projects in a way that meets Egypt's and Africa's interests. In December 2018, the Tanzanian government assigned the construction contract of the century's biggest turnkey project on African soil with a cost of $3 billion to the Egyptian joint venture of the Arab contractors and El Sawedi Electric to work along with Tanzania Electric Supply Company, Tanesco. It's been a year of round-the-clock toil. After completion of basic engineering, real work with detailed engineering and construction has begun to start writing history. Today, in December 2019, remarkable on-ground accomplishments can already be seen, serving the emergence of African-driven agenda for African economic emancipation. Before starting the construction of the 1,025-meter-long dam, builders had to divert the path of Rufija River first through a 700-meter-long D-shaped diversion tunnel on the left bank of the river. Excavation through the diversion tunnel is now in progress, along with temporary rock support before final concrete lining. For this tunnel to be done in the minimum possible time, along with working from both ends, the inlet and outlets portals, an approximately 145 meter long adit has been excavated to break through the tunnel from the middle, to be working with four screws simultaneously. For an average annual electricity production of about 6,300 gigawatt hour, and an installed capacity of 2,115 megawatt, a giant powerhouse will be built on the right bank of the river with an open-air excavation volume of about 2.5 million cubic meters. It started at an elevation of almost 160 meters above sea level. Today, it has already reached an approximate elevation of 148 meters and work is ongoing up to a level of 142 meters. The project will cast a total estimate volume of 3 million cubic meters of reinforced and roller compacted concrete using six conventional concrete batching plants and three crushing plants. Civil and steel structure works have started for the batching plants on the left bank along with concrete labs in addition to finalizing the initial batching and crushing plants. As part of the project mobilization, the access roads to the right and left banks have undergone a major upgrade along with the process of building camps on the site for Tanesco and the Egyptian joint venture staff. Around 6,000 workers and engineers will be working on this mega project at the construction peak. And the progress continues.